Hello everybody, we are back here on the Hunter Call of the Wild, and today we are out here on Hirschfelden for the first time in about a month. We don't really head out to Hirschfelden too much, so I thought it might be fun to jump into some Hirschfelden multiplayer and see if we can find ourselves some trophies. Now, I'm not the best at this map. I definitely will uh, be the first person to say that I don't know a ton about all of the areas that animals will be on Hirschfelden because I don't play this map a whole lot. So we're going to see if we can find anything. It's going to be pretty interesting, but I'm just hoping that we can have some sort of luck and maybe find at least a semi-decent trophy. And it sounds like we got rabbits already, so I guess we can see if we've got any good ones here. And that actually, that actually could be a good one, so I think that's a good way to start out. Let's go ahead and get that guy down and see if it's any good. Uh, to be honest, I really didn't expect a rabbit to be our first trophy of the day, but considering its weight, this one does have a chance at being a level 2 diamond. And it's just a gold, but that is a 2.20, which is a very solid bunny. That's actually not bad at all. That's a really good one, and a pretty awesome way to start the day. Okay, so that's a really interesting looking fallow deer, and uh, to be honest, it looks a little bit dark as well. However, I think it's probably just the shadows. But, you know, fingers crossed that it actually is something special. Well, I was right about it being a little bit darker. However, it is just the darker common variation, which is the dark spotted. 159.60, a very wide fallow buck. Definitely a bit wider than what you would typically see here. So with us having just got host of this server, we will probably go search for some European bison. Hopefully we will end up bagging ourselves a nice one. It has been a bit since I've got a good trophy off of Hirschfelden, and I would like it to be a European bison considering this is the only map that you can find them. But this is probably going to be a bit of a shorter video than normal because as most of you know by now, we are currently in the midst of our 50k celebration week where we're doing a 5 hour live stream five days in a row and we just finished the recent one as I'm recording this or I guess the first one as I'm recording this where we played Call of the Wild and Bigfoot and it was a lot of fun if you guys didn't see it then you can always go back and look at it in the VOD here on the channel I would definitely recommend it because it was a ton of fun and that is a red deer well, anyway, as I was saying, you guys are not going to want to miss the rest of these because the next one that we're going to be doing is the Hunter Primal, which should be quite a bit of fun. So stay tuned for that. It will be later on today. And yeah, with that being said, let's continue the hunt. All right, we just got the call of our very first European bison of the day. Let's see if this thing is any decent size. I did pick up a track from a good size level four. I'm going to assume it was a max weight estimate, so I'm guessing it's probably a level four. If it's a level 5 though, that would be pretty amazing as well. Uh, we can go ahead and use the night vision to hopefully get a better view of these. But uh, we'll see. Okay, uh, we gotta take a bit of a detour. I don't really care too much about those European bison anymore. Especially since there wasn't anything good and we just found ourselves a 12 to 15 kg red fox track. That's a little more interesting to me. Considering that has a chance at being a diamond one, so we should probably get on that and hope that we can end up tracking it down. Uh, there's also a female with it, but I don't really care too much to chase after a female. This 12 to 15 is what I'm interested in. There we go. So that is the female, but most likely she is with the one that we're after. Just fingers crossed that this is a level 9. If this is a level 9, that would honestly just be... The perfect way to come back to Hirschfelden, especially since it's been a while since we've had a good trophy here, and that's our female. So he's got to be close. Okay, so that's a just now track, which means this thing can't be too far away. We've got to be coming up on it now. So I better be 100% ready to just take any shot that it gives us because we may not get too many shots here. Ah, oh, it's just a mythical. Well, that's unfortunate, but let's just get it down. Even if it is just a mythical, we chased it for quite a bit, so we do want to get a shot into it and take it down. I mean, it is one of the bigger foxes I've seen in months, so I guess that's the positive. But man, it would have been nice if it was a level 9. That would have just been all too perfect, but instead it's a 13.50 gold. I guess that's still not bad though. It's still a decent trophy. So we found a pretty hefty red deer track at 210 to 240 kgs. However, I did spook this thing off from what I can tell. 
So we are going to have to wait for him to come back, but we'll give him a couple minutes and he should return to his zone. Hopefully he'll end up being a big one and not just an average size level 7. Uh, that looks like our red deer right there. As far as I can tell, that looks like a level 7. It looks to be big, whatever it is. Yeah, that is a level 7. That's definitely the one that we were after. Uh, maybe we can put a shot into it like that. I think that should have actually connected, so... Let's hope that it did. I, I think it did, at least. Well, I am incredibly shocked, but pleasantly surprised that that actually was a vital hit. And to be honest, I wasn't sure if it made it or not, considering we shot directly through all the brush. But sure enough, we ended up getting ourselves a nice vital hit, and that guy went down pretty quickly. Very nice looking level 7 as well. So I have fast traveled towards the top of the map up here in... Uh, Mullerwald, kind of. I guess it's kind of around the Mullerwald area. It's at the Mullerwald Western Outpost, and basically we're just gonna run south, and the first good track we come across is what we will chase down, and maybe that's gonna lead us to something good. I've had tracks lead to some great trophies in the past. I'm really hoping that that will be the case this time, so let's just do this and see if we can find anything good. Well, that's not really what I was intending to search for today, but that is a melanistic rabbit. Now, these aren't really, like, super hard to find, but they're still kind of cool to get down every time you do see them. So, we might as well take that thing out and attempt to get one of those as well, which that went terribly, but we got the melanistic one. That's really all that matters. Let's go pick that thing up. Very interested to see if it actually is melanistic, because I think, yes, it is. That's definitely melanistic, so... We did get something. I mean, it's not really a rare. These are more of an uncommon, unless things have changed uh, in the last couple updates. I don't think these are a rare anymore, but, or actually really don't think they've been a rare ever. But just in case, we'll put it in the trophy manager, just to be on the safe side. This way, if I later find out that it is considered a rare now, I can always come back and taxidermize it. But last time I checked, they're not rare. They're just an uncommon. And with, unfortunately, nothing showing up and myself not having too much time left to record, I think we're going to end things on this little road deer since we have not shot one this entire video. Let's go ahead and just get a shot into it. And let's get its buddy down as well while we have the chance to. Well, these are the last two kills of the video and we will go ahead and claim the smaller one first. 5350 and then this guy is a 5620 neither of them all that big but uh still something we hadn't shot today so i figured we might as well get them down now we will probably have a longer video tomorrow hopefully this one was a little bit short because i really was uh not prepared to have to record this late the uh stream that we did was a lot of fun i really enjoyed doing the longer stream but because of that I didn't really have too much time to, to uh, prepare this video, so I hope you guys still enjoy this even though it wasn't uh, trophy packed or anything like that. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you're brand new to the channel, be sure to subscribe, click that like button, and ring that notification bell so that you guys will never miss any of the future uploads. Also be sure to leave a comment down below on what you think we should do next because I am running out of ideas of like unique videos that we could do here on Call of the Wild with no update in sight as of now and us really not knowing when there will be a new update. I'm kind of running out of things that we can do that are different from stuff we've already done, but let me know what you guys think we should do and I'll see if there's any ideas down there that I like. With that being said, thank you all for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Peace!